debate over how to save a passenger rail service from Indianapolis to Chicago is moving into negotiations. As News 18 previously reported, Amtrak's Hoosier State Line, which includes a stop in Lafayette, will shut down if nearly $3 million of funding is not found by October 1st. Now, NDOT and Amtrak are beginning negotiations to keep the trains running. Governor Mike Pence authorized negotiations last week and supports a joint effort involving state money and local funding from communities along the route. NDOT estimates the cost at $80 in government support for every one-way ticket. NDOT spokesman Will Wingfield says that number is based on 2012's ridership of the Hoosier State Line, which he says was more than 36,000 passengers. One of the things we're looking at in, in making this service more sustainable over the long run is, you know, what can we do to increase ridership and revenue such that less government support is needed. Wingfield says NDOT plans to present a cost-benefit study on Amtrak service and options to a state committee later this week. He says Amtrak will not stop service in states holding good-faith contract negotiations by October 1st.